Ron Goodall, fighthype.com. I'm here with rising superstar, Abdullah Mason. What's going on, man? Man, you know, we working, you know, just waiting on the next thing. You know, uh, first and foremost, how's the weather out in Cleveland? Is it is it is it cold or anything, man? Like, you know? Cleveland weather be bi bipolar. So right now it's, you know, more leaning towards the cold side, but you know, you get some warmer days and some days get colder. You know, it's a little chill today. I have to ask because you got the it looks like a clean scully going on on the top right there. So Yeah. It that's a, is that uh everybody that's watching, y'all go grab your new scully, the M five scully. It's a reversible hat, so you know you get the you get the black side, the white side. You know, just had it on, so make sure y'all go grab yours. And the M five yeah. is uh, uh the the Mason five, right? Yeah, Mason five. Yeah, it's me and my brothers M five. Yeah, so Mason Brothers Boxing dot shop in order to grab the hats. They twenty dollars right now, so make sure y'all go grab them. And you can yeah. cop that uh that fresh hoodie as well, right? Uh, not the hoodie just yet. Not the hoodie just yet. Okay, so that's just a that's an exclusive right there. So it's just a sneak peek. Yeah. So um, so I I definitely just have to the jump into the whole Mason Five, right? You it's four professional, and the fifth one is going to make his pro debut with your brothers on April sixth, right? That's the youngest brother right there. He about to he about to be pro. Uh, he, he gonna be pro fight coming up in Cleveland. Uh, he out here over there chilling right now, but uh, <laughs> it's gonna be a nice car April six. Is he is he just vibing back there too? Just chilling and you know, and you guys just relaxing. Hey, my brothers over here chilling. You know they just you know they quiet down so so I see my <laughs> hey y'all y'all come on yeah yeah they over here laying around chilling. What's up? What's you know, up? I always I always What's have up? my brother with me so. So they always yeah, somewhere each other, no matter what, you know. What up? What up? What's up? Yeah. What's up, man? You know the whole fight hype. You know, is checking all you guys out, man. So we're all impressed with you guys. So yeah, so they're gonna be doing their thing April six. You know, my my youngest brother, this one, this the youngest right here. Yeah. Yeah. People be calling him yeah. my twin. They don't ever tell us. <laughs> he be catching my hands. They be like, "Who catching yeah. who? Like, <laughs> is Brian catching himself?" <laughs> So, yeah. so, so just, just the dynamics, right? You guys obviously all box, but how do you guys cohesively react to just anything in the world? Like you guys come together, someone rolls up, say, yo, what's up, man? We, I want some smoke, man. I, I saw you all boxing. Do you guys all jump in or you just let? Hey, I mean, we, we all, we already all in. So, so, so they roll up, they know how we coming. Uh, you know, all five of us, we train each other. We stay in the gym with each other. So, you know, it's the Mason five, you know, it's the family. I gotta ask real quick. You guys all competitive with each other? Like, if you, someone pulls up like a a game of dominoes, you guys are competing. You know, I mean, pretty pretty much, pretty much. Sometimes I'm like, yeah, I ain't messing with y'all. You know, I don't feel like that today. But you know, so other days we like, yeah, let's get it. <laughs> you know, say it right. Yeah. Say it you depends. <laughs> you said it depends. <laughs> yeah, it depends. Like, I might I might get my little brother in a, in a chess match here and there. So. Ooh. <laughs> is that is that a, a a normal call out you guys just call each other out and just like simple little chess games sometimes you know a little challenges you know we, get, we like to have fun you gotta have you gotta have some fun with it awesome yeah. well I, I do have to ask since we brought up the word challenge right you know the boxing world was definitely locked on to a little back and forth on twitter and you know someone seemed a little you know, wary of the Abdullah Mason name, you know, it, it seemed that Shakur has been going back and forth with Kid Austin and, and Kid Austin seemed real adamant on the Shakur Stevenson fight. Um, yeah. Even the idea of maybe fighting Zapata for a Shakur mm -hmm. Stevenson fight. But the idea of um, maybe a June fight with you and Kid Austin was brought up and you did the handshake emojis, right? 100% down. But I didn't see that exchange back right away. So I just have to get your thoughts on um, that whole thing. Cause I mean, so so the way I look at it is, you know, Kid Austin, you know, he, he a good up and coming fighter. He a great prospect. And um, he calling Shakur out. He calling uh, Devin out. He calling, you know, the champions out. And, you know, he want a piece of everybody, you know, and he want to jump straight to that right now. So, so you know, what everybody's saying, he hasn't accomplished that. 
you know, he hasn't got there yet or uh, he got to work his way up the rankings. If he won it now, you know, and they throwing me his way, I believe, you know, if that's what he's saying, he won. He won, he won everybody, then why not do it? You know, I'm an up-and-coming prospect. I'm with it, you know. So I'll be, you know, I'm I'm with it, you know, straight with it, yeah. Yeah, what do you say? That's a, that's a quick yeah. and easy way to get <laughs> That's a, that's a shortcut right there. So, so I, yeah, Shakur, right? yeah, that's a short. That's his shortcut to Shakur. You know, and Shakur throwing my way. You know, I'm ready. I'm with it. You know, I could fight him in June. So mm. if he would, I'll be fighting in June. Now I gotta. I'll play devil's advocate, right? I'll be in like an Oscar De La Hoya seat, right? I got my fighter right here. You know, why? Why would you know? Why would I maybe try to send him to you? You say that again. Oh no, I, I'm you know I'll put the the Oscar De La Hoya hat on, right? Like you know why would I send my fighter to what Shakur called you, Debo in this situation? Why why would I send my fighter over to you when that could potentially ruin my opportunity for a big fight with a lot of money on the line? You know? Right. Well, I mean, I mean he said he wanted and he ready for anybody, you know. So so if 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 I got to be the next in line. Why not do it? Let's make boxing great again. Do, do you feel that, and I don't want to put the word like avoiding or ducking and things like that, right? Because, you know, everyone's fighters and I respect that. But do you feel like when it comes to kind of all the smoke and I want that Shakur Stevenson fight at all costs, do you, do you feel like there's a little bit of hesitation, that little, I don't want to use the word duck, right? Because that's, that's, but risk, the risk management is huge when it comes to fighting someone like yourself. Would you, would you think that's the case? Um, I mean, possibly. I mean, I feel like he he, he think his best move is to fight Shakur. And, um, you know, if uh, he want to go through William Zapata, then that's what he's going to do. So they threw me his way and, you know, we just seeing how he's moving. Is, do you think um, reading between the lines that William Zapata is a safer yeah. fight? Then Ab Abdullah Mason, like just just putting that you know out there. I would rather so, go with William Zapata. You start over again. Oh yeah, I was saying. Do you feel that maybe yeah. the idea of going through William Zapata is a safer route than a, a a slick counter puncher who's throwing like five hooks and landing all five of them? Like, do you feel? I mean, I don't say he's ready, so you know. Okay, I mean, all right. <laughs> I do know that his dad went out and said, hey, why don't we set up like Keyshawn Davis and Abdullah Mason? And in a sense, you know, around that time. Do you think that same energy applies that he was trying to put the Keyshawn Davis in you, but not wanting to insert his son in the same situation? And uh, I mean, people are going to say what they're going to say. Why do you, you say anything you said, yeah. that, Abdullah? So why, why do you think he I think, you know, I think he said that because, uh, you know, uh, I think he want to make it seem like me and him, you know, you know, we right here with it, you know, and so say he pushing me over to Keyshawn because I'm his guy, but that's not really the case. Hey, Ron, yeah. you playing a survivor like that TV show. Yeah, yeah. That's, <laughs> no survivor. They, you know, they, they, uh, they play and they get, get the other person together. They, they, uh, interrogate the two so they could. Elimination. Shoot, yeah, elimination process. Mm. Elimination. Okay, okay. So so he's trying to move you away so that he can go straight, to, you know, and this is a senior. Hey, Abdullah, Keyshawn, please, you guys go over there, right? Because I don't, we don't really necessarily want to take that road so we can go straight to Shakur. But, but it sounds like you guys recognize the move. Right. Yeah. I mean... So, I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna entertain it too much. You know, it's seeming like he not, he not really with it. So, so, so I'm with it on my side. But, but you know, I'm ready. If he's ready, I'm ready. But you know, I got another day coming up. So, so I'll be announcing that soon. But if he with it, I'm still with it. Okay, respect. And this is, and and I put in like the most fair way. This is a respectful conversation flow of just like, look, I see you. You want a dance partner to yeah. get to Shakur? I could be that dance partner. You know? hey, hey, Ron, hey, Ron, tell him, man, we trying to make boxing great again. I'm doing show, show. Hey, hey, come on. That's, that's, that's what it say. Stay on the joint. Make boxing great again. Make, so. make boxing great again. Yeah.
So, who, yeah. so whoever with it, you know, let's make boxing. Hey, there. whatever boxing asking for, whatever the people asking for, whatever they want to see, let's do it. Okay, you know? so I respect that. So at any point, if it, if it's Kid Austin or I mean, I'll be honest, I haven't heard anyone ask for a duel with Mason. So I mean, I mean, it's. Maybe the future boogeyman in the division later on? Only got 12 fights, too. So, you know, he working his way up. He going to get there. It's yeah, going to come. It's, it's a time for everything, you know. Mm -hmm. if, if Kid Austin want to wanna, 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 wanna go trade the core and he put me in a way, so I'm ready for it. So yeah. I'll ask, you know, I, I'm doing all the fun, you know, instigating, kind of like, you know, drawing up the, the map of a good fight. But, like, you know, I'll add one tough question in here, but just for the people who's kind of going like, all right, you're being pushed over here. See, uh, Floyd Schofield Sr. is like, hey, Abdullah, need, Keyshawn should fight Abdullah. And then Shakur is like, hey, if you want to get to me, you got to fight Abdullah Kid Austin. Do, do you feel that at some point that people is going to bring up, hey, why don't Abdul and Shakur face each other, which I know that you guys aren't going to face each other, but just for those fans who's going to ask that question, why aren't you guys, I guess, why is it okay for you to be the guy to facilitate if Kid Austin can come to Shakur? If that makes sense. Because that's, that's what Shakur, is, I mean, that's what uh, Kid Austin is doing. He's calling Shakur out. You know, that's what he wants. He's adamant about it. And, you know, um, I'm right there. So, so I'm right there with top rank and it'd be easy. It'd be easy. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Think about it though. He did. He put. He he was trying to set up the fight with you and somebody else. Yeah, yeah. He trying to he try to play matchmaker himself. Yeah, you so, know. Yeah, yeah. So Kid Austin trying to trying to put me right there, and um, you know, I feel like I feel like that's what that's what he want to do right now. I'm I'm going along with my with the process, and I'm building my, you know, I'm you know I'm stepping in there, you know, a steady building, steady, you know, having him step up fights. But you know, if you want to hurry up and go to Shakur. You know, and they throw me right there. I'm ready for them. You know, that's a good, that's a good step up fight for me right there. That's a good prospect up and coming. You know, and I'll be ready. I'm gonna keep working my way up the ranks. And once I get right there to the belt, I'll be ready to challenge whoever's at the top of the belt. I see. So the, the just break it like I want to make sure I understand. You respect the hierarchy. You respect hey the process of what it takes to become a contender, a mandatory, and fight a, a champion. I can't just jump up there. Yeah. And, because you recognize that they've already tried. This is way before Shakur and said, hey, Abdul, and that they tried to weaponize you. Hey, Keyshawn needs to fight. So you recognize that they're trying to play so game. So it's like, hey, how about you have a son in my division? Why don't we do this so that if you don't respect the hierarchy, we can make it happen, right? Right, right. And, I, you know, I never call nobody out like that. Um, they threw him at me. And you know, so I'm with it. I'm with it. That's it makes sense. Okay. And everything and this, happen when it's supposed to, you know. Yeah, everything gonna happen like when it's supposed to, like you just said. Yeah. And but if the fight doesn't happen and and, and you so maybe that's the fight that later on where they feel that that reward yeah. might match and and possibly. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Just ready for you know. It's like I said, I got a I got a date coming up right now, so I'm not too worried about it. You know, so we just you know we focus, we locked in, and we gonna keep going.